for today's video, we will be exploring the most popular states where retirees are flocking to in 2023. 80% of retirees choose to relocate. Curious about where they're all moving to? Stay tuned! Millions of Americans retire annually, and there are a lot of reasons why retirees change states. It may be for a change of scenery, a more affordable cost of living, or to be closer to loved ones. The statistics for this video are based on the U.S. Census Community Survey. Let's get it! Number 10. Louisiana 3.5% of state-switching retirees end up in Louisiana. It isn't really expensive here. They also have a very fine climate. The winters are freezing cold. Louisiana may be an alternative option for those who are looking to move to Florida but find it a bit too expensive. They have very similar weather. Hurricane, watch out! Yeah, they get hurricanes. Stay alert! But anyway, with this decent weather, you can comfortably go fishing if, you know, you're into that. Number 9. Maine 5.1% of state-switching retirees choose to go to Maine. If you ain't got no problem with freezing temperatures, then you really don't have much to complain about when you're in Maine. It's a great place for retirees. The summers and springs are simply amazing. If you have an outdoorsy lifestyle, you can continue living like that in Maine, since they have a lot of outdoor recreational activities. Gardening, fishing, hiking, camping, you can even go hunting. They have great wines and craft beers. They also got fresh seafood. I heard a story before about someone who chose to move here because he loved the food too much. That can be you as well. It can be a little expensive here, but hey, if you can handle that, then it's really a good place to retire. Number 8. Georgia A total of 6.3% of state-switching retirees choose Georgia. Why? Well, they're a very tax-friendly state. The weather is always perfect with an annual temperature of 64 degrees. If you love golf, then the golf communities here, like the landings, are among the most sought-after locations to achieve that luxurious senior lifestyle. The state has a low cost of living and a light tax burden. They're actually ranked number 7 in terms of affordability. If you're looking for a city that can match your newly discovered lifestyle, Savannah, Georgia can be the perfect place to start. Number 7. Arkansas 6.5% of retirees that choose to move end up in Arkansas. Arkansas's reputation has been leaning more towards the positive side. You stay out of Little Rock and Pine Bluff, then you're good. An outdoorsy lifestyle is perfect here. They got great amenities and activities for hunting, fishing, camping, boating, basically anything you want and can do outside, you can. Arkansas's low cost of living, which is 10.1% lower than a national average. The typical house here costs $176,293, and the average Medicare premiums are $44.34. Number 6. Kansas With 7% of retirees choosing Kansas as their retirement haven, it's really no wonder why it's gotten so popular among retirees. They have a quiet and relaxing life. A lot of people who are living the RV life choose this state as their home base, and for the rest of the year, they'll travel around the country. The community is close-knit. If you ever need them to check on your house, if you're away, you can definitely count on them. It's close to most services, it's affordable, and they have a low crime rate. Number 5. South Carolina Were you surprised? Another southern state. The 8.4% of state-switching retirees flock to coastal communities of South Carolina, like Myrtle Beach, Columbia. You can also see a great number of military retirees since they have access to military hospitals. It makes sense that they would move close to a major military post. I also find this a bit strange. The beaches there are nice, don't get me wrong. It's decent, but they're not exactly that exciting. It seemed a bit run down. 
This may be a perfect place specifically for people that have military ties. Number four, we just go to our neighbor, North Carolina. Like twins, they share a plethora of positive things. They also have military bases here. They're quite affordable and the coastal communities are great for retirees. Popular places are like Wilmington, a coastal city in Jacksonville. You wouldn't have to worry much about your medical needs since the Raleigh-Durham area has some of the best hospitals in the country. The percentage of state switching retirees who choose North Carolina as their new home is 10.3%. Before we go to our top three, don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. What do you think of this one so far? Do you already have a state in mind that you would like to retire to? Maybe the next three will help you make a decision. Number three, Pennsylvania. They have similar weather to New England, but it's more affordable here. I think that's what attracts a lot of retirees, especially the ones who are retiring from Massachusetts and want a change of scenery, but don't want to move out too far. A lot of things are similar, but you're living a lot cheaper in a place that you're already familiar with. They can also accommodate active outdoor lifestyles. If you're into fishing or hunting, you might not associate the state as having the best spaces to do these things, but they got great ponds, creeks, and river lakes. In Hansdale, Pennsylvania, there's a huge hospital. See where I'm going with this? Retirees. Hospital. Look, I'm not saying that all retirees need medical care all the time. It's just that it's good to know you can be taken care of if something bad happens. 10.7% of state switching retirees find themselves in Pennsylvania. Taking the number two spot, Florida. I know, right? The most stereotypical place to retire is now number two. Florida has great coastal and inland retirement areas. The weather here is beautiful all year round. Dubbed the Sunshine State, you can enjoy 237 days of sunshine. If you're thinking about taxes, Florida is a lot less taxing, since apart from the social security benefits that you can enjoy, they have no inheritance tax or estate tax. The 55 plus active adult communities here will ensure that you have lots of living options to choose from. Fitness centers, swimming pools, and convenient services are all here in Florida. 11.3% of state switching retirees settle in this sunshine state. Number one, Tennessee. Tennessee has officially drawn in more retirees than Florida. They have good programs for retirees. A lot of people who move to Nevada, Arizona, Oregon, even the ones from Southern California all came back. But the ones in Tennessee stayed in Tennessee. They have great outdoor activities in affordable and beautiful land. One other thing why the state attracts a lot of retirees is because Tennessee does not tax social security benefits or other forms of retirement income in any way. Talk about savings. That's it for this video, guys. I hope we gave you some ideas on where to retire next. If you're looking to retire outside of the US, we've made a video just for you. Check out the ultimate 12 islands for a relaxing retirement in 2023. Continue expanding your world IQ.